Hi everyone, Matt Foster with What's Hot at Shot 2023 exclusively at GetZone.com. We're here to show the latest we've seen at the shot show that's caught our eye. And one thing in particular is the Ruger SFAR, which stands for Small Frame Auto Loading Rifle. This is a great rifle because it's chambered in 308, but it's very similar in size to an AR-15, thus the small frame nomenclature. So to tell us a little bit more about it, we have Matt with Ruger. Yeah, thank you. Uh, so SFAR, small frame auto loading rifle, is right now just chambered in 308 Winchester. Okay. And what we have here is our 16 inch barrel model. We also have a 20, but this sits at 6.8 pounds unloaded and just a hair over seven as a 20 inch gun. Okay. So what, basically what enables this to be roughly the size of, you know, a small frame auto loading rifle? and be chambered in 308 though. So, because the, the lower does look a little different. Yeah. Smaller back here like an AR, but large barrel tape. So what, so what exactly has gone on here to put this together? So bespoke upper and lower receiver, because obviously this, this uh, 7.62 magazine is huge compared to a 5.56 AR-15 okay. magazine. So bigger through that section to accommodate the longer and wider cartridge stack, but everything else just shifts back behind it. So this is AR-15 pattern, fire control, and grip, and bus stock. Even the charging handle, it's all compatible with AR-15 pattern components. Okay, very good. And then it's the bolt and the barrel extension, the material we build this out of, that's where the engineering really lives that allows us to put that bigger cartridge into this size of a gun. Okay, very good. Now what about, um, for instance, like the gas block? So you know, any of the uh, gas tubes? Yeah, we use a, uh, a standard 750 diameter gas block journal. This is a mid-length gas system, but it's our own regulated gas block. So there's three different gas hole positions. Oh, so, uh, so it's adjustable. It is. So we have a larger gas hole that works well with lower powered 7.62 NATO ammunition or just during the break-in of a rifle. Setting two is the general purpose tree at Winchester. And then setting one is really ideal for suppressed use. Okay, excellent. And standard muzzle brake? Yep, 5 8 24. We have our two port boomer brake. It's a brake, it's loud. It does a great job of taming recoil and we're glad to have it on this gun. Okay, very good. Now, what about the handguard? Is that interchangeable with anything if somebody really wants to or, I mean, not that they would want to, but. Well, that's the beauty of an AR type rifle though, is that it is. Uh, so our handguard is only compatible with our barrel dump, but thankfully most aftermarket handguards have their own system uh, and it all fits up just fine. Okay, very good. For me, it's always, this is a gun that you need to feel it okay. because when you compare it to an AR-10, we're talking about a bigger rifle, it's bigger in every direction, it's heavier. Uh, and while AR-10s are fun to shoot, this, uh, this ends up just feeling like It's gonna feel more like, like an, an AR-15. AR. This is gonna feel more like an AR-15. Yeah. So, it's not nearly as clunky as, a, as an AR-10. AR not at all. It feels no, it does feel identical really, yeah, in the hand. There's, and, no way, uh, there's no way you would think this is chambered in 308. Ag agreed. So for us, every time we can get it in somebody's hands, especially at a range event where they go, I've shot an AR-15. Okay, well, it's not an AR-15. Or I have an AR-10. Well, this is not an AR-10. And so it comes with Magpul furniture, correct? Yep, yep. Magpul okay. furniture, Magpul magazine. How um, many magazines come with the, with the rifle? Just one. Okay, just yep. one, fair enough. What is the MSRP on the SF, SFAR? Uh, MSRP is $1,329. It's not uh, bad, not of course, bad at we all. We rarely see things selling on MSRP. So, so of course, uh, you fair need to check enough. that out. So that's the SFAR from Ruger. For more information, you can visit Ruger.com. And of course, for more information about what's hot at the SHOT Show 2023, visit GetZone.com. Thanks.